guys welcome to my channel is nanaya choices here once again i'm nanaya hi if you're new subscribe okay let's be friends let's be a big family and let's keep going okay so as promised i did mention in my vows video that i was going to come on here and then show you guys an update since i relaxed my hair so no this is not my hair <laughs> she's awake honey thank you <laughs> and um, yes i made this wig myself if you would like me to do a glueless wig for you like this one send me a dm on instagram okay and we'll talk about that but that's not the point of this video by the way so as promised i did say i was gonna come on here and share with you guys updates on how my hair is doing so far what am i doing to it how we can proceed and all that good stuff okay so first things first i relaxed my hair was it a day before Rousey or two days before Rousey? If you watch the updates, you know. <laughs> and so since then, we have approximately, yeah, like in our fourth week, four weeks post relaxer so stands now. And these are the things I've done to my hair so far. So, one week post relaxer, I did my regular wash day routine. And I, I told you guys that I'm going through a setback. I'm trying to bounce back. Mm. <laughs> That was so cringy. Oh my god. I am trying to bounce back from a setback that I had. So I've been trying to baby my hair. Okay. And nurture my hair back to health. And um, I was also going through a couple of private stuff. So my hair just took the brunt of it. Like my hair was going through a lot. Because I was going through a lot. Okay. So we were all going through a lot. <laughs> Even regardless, my hair was still, at least I was trying to still cooperate whenever I tried to do things to get it to go back. So that's where we are at. I have washed my hair. I did wash my hair and I just left my hair alone. My hair was in a bun for the most of the time when I was going to the gym and stuff like that. My hair was up in a ponytail or in a bun and it was fine. Then in the second week, mind you this entire time i have been using my hair oil and then my hair tea so my hair tea like i mentioned previously that i'm still trying it out to you know get the formula right so that when it's ready i can share with you guys and make it available for purchase like usually before i post and share anything i make sure that i have tested it out and i've been testing out my hair tea for the past it's not for the past three months we are in now fourth month as we stand so i want to make sure that i test it out well before i give it out for people to you know give it a try and stuff like that so i've only been using my hair oil and my hair tea in my hair just that nothing else i've not been doing anything extra i have not been taking any hair vitamins i have not been doing anything because my skin is currently purging a lot um so if you, i come forward you can see a couple of you know yeah was it because i wasn't my you know what i mean <laughs> so my skin is getting through a lot i am going through a lot and at least now i'm getting better so everything is kind of working out eventually <laughs> and i'm excited about that as part of that i've only been using my hair tea and my hair oil in my hair that's it so the first week hair was in a bun second week hair was in a bun the third week though because i was coming to celebrate my birthday which was the second march i decided to straighten my hair for my birthday i was supposed to wear a wig but i was that i was supposed to wear this wig <laughs> but i was done because i didn't feel like doing it for my birthday so i just wanted to you know straighten my hair for a bit and i straightened my hair and i realized that like i could clearly see the well i didn't straighten i blow dried it but it was fairly straight so i could see the areas of the damage and stuff like that so of course but one part was severely cut i'll try and set pictures you guys can see what i'm talking about one part was severely cut remember sometime last year that was in october when i went to get my hair relaxed the, i asked i told you guys i was going through a setback so i did ask the lady to you know go ahead and cut some parts off but after she was like, usually she, she puts layers in my hair but i think she cut one side too much because my hair was in the middle was in the side part so she cut one side a lot this side so that you know the that part can layer up but then now that everything is straight you can see that that part is been cut off like a big chunk anyway i'm not stressing out over it i did try to even it out a bit because there were some parts that were way longer than the others so i have gone back and cut those areas 
just to kind of even things out a bit I have been doing the search and destroy method where I just look at my ends I see a split hair cut see a split hair I cut see a split end I cut and yeah that's what I've been doing so far and I've had this wig on well I braided my hair for a wig last week so it's only been a week I'm going into my second week and that will mean we are four weeks post relaxer so hopefully by the time this video goes up I will be like at least one week into it and I can give you guys an update on what I'm going to be doing but moving forward though I will be keeping my hair in braids like in cornrows and wearing my wigs and just using my hair tea using my hair oil and that's it I'm not going to be doing anything extra to my hair because I'm trying to baby my hair so that it's going to go back and then I can share everything with you guys but um that's just good to show you that even when you are advanced in hair care setbacks can happen okay stress diet life the water you're using to wash your hair a lot of things can happen to cause setbacks but the most important thing is that when you do get setback figure out what is causing the setback and fix it so I have figured out mine mine was stress and bad eating habits <laughs> and bad hair care habits because I neglected my hair but now I'm getting back to the place where I'm loving it again she's loving me back I mean I have a relationship <laughs> Let me know what your thoughts are down in the comment section below. If you have gone through a setback, kindly comment down below how the setback was like, what probably caused the setback, and how you are also getting back on track. Also, if you guys would like me to post like a hair challenge that we can all embark on and go our hair together and this hair back together, let me know down in the comment section. And you know, we'll come right at you after that. Okay, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Mwah. And yes, I'm in a happy mood. <laughs> Bye, guys.